Hi guys, it's Mary Ellen. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, thanks for stopping by. Today's video is a big plan with me. So if you use a big happy planner or you're just interested in seeing what I do with mine, stay tuned. guys, it's Mary Ellen. Today I'm planning for the week of June 22nd through the 28th. This is in my big happy planner. This is Teresa Collins planner. Um, and it is pretty neutral, but there's these peach lines. So I'm definitely going to be covering them up this week. Um, I'm also going to be using the Color Me Happy book. I just got this one and I really haven't used it yet. And there's these fun, bright colors in here. And I know I did a rainbow spread last week, but I am excited to use this. So I think I'm, I'm going to do that today. So I have some washi tape. Um, this one I got at Joann's. I forget the brand. It might be Park Lane. And this is just Scotch brand. And we're going to see what we can do with this. I also might be using um, the Doodle Bug Design black. Here it is. This black washi tape. I think I'm going to do like a combination of black and color, which you guys know I do like to do sometimes. So let's get started and I'm just going to place this at the top and then we will go from there. Please forgive my fingernails. Um, we are still, we still don't have nail salons open here in PA. And I've been so busy, like trying to get caught up on all this video stuff that I just keep forgetting to do my nails. So it is what it is. I wanted to film a video today and I was like, yeah, I think I'm just going to do it anyway. They'll understand. <laughs> pretty soon we'll be going back to the regularly scheduled pretty nails. But for now, you know, it is what it is. Okay, so I have these um, black washi tapes down. Let's just look through this book. I think I want to use yellow. I love yellow. I'm going to definitely be covering that up. Um, I just want to use like some bright fun colors. And also I was looking at these flowers from the Brights mega sticker pack. I've never used them because I don't love them. Um, but they do match like the colors in this book pretty much. So I thought maybe today would be the day that I use these. I'm just trying to figure out like how to use them. How do I want to use them? Typically with flowers, I will put them in like corners and things, but I don't know if I want to do that this time. I might go down the bottom and put some flowers along there. Or maybe I'll do it like up here. I could do it all the way across up here, or I could do some up here and some down here or over here. It's hard to know what to do sometimes. Let's start by putting some flowers here, and then we'll go from there. Um, I don't know if I want to use the clear ones or the paper ones. I guess probably the clear ones if I'm like, well, let's see what the color difference would be like. I think the um, the paper ones might be a little brighter. So maybe I'll do that. Yeah, they're gonna be brighter and clearer. I typically go for the clear stickers because I love the translucent stickers, but um, I'm not gonna do it this time. Going away from what I usually do going to cut these up and let's just check out the colors in here to make sure see if there's any green it doesn't look like there's any green it looks like oh wait there's a little bit but that's more of like a turquoise so maybe I try to like is there two pages of these no but there's these too Maybe I try to avoid the green in there if I can. Also, I'm not gonna want this peach color. 
um, or the red. Wait, is there red? There's red in here. Okay, then I want the red. Let's just um, see what I can do. Okay, I think that looks really bright and cheerful and I know they're not like really balanced, but that's okay because we're gonna put a lot of other stickers in here so they don't have to be perfect. So let's just see what we can do here. Um, we're gonna bring in some black things too, like maybe those important. Um, maybe one of these in the sidebar. Let's just see what we have. I want black and I want colorful. This may be what I'm using for my gratitude, although this yellow is so different than that one that it's kind of bugging me. But let's see. How about this for my gratitude on a happy note? I love like this shape box for gratitude the best and I pretty much typically put it down here on Saturday and Sunday. For some reason that makes me happy i don't know i do that a lot so now like i said i think we're gonna go in the sidebar and get like a long box sticker we could use this but that's a bit much for me in this spread so let's go back to those black long boxes and we'll put one of those in there this is gonna be probably for my priorities for the week um or things i have to buy i don't know yet i use them for different things all the time okay before i do anything else i'm going to um cover this up because it's not making me happy with having that peach next to all these bright colors so let me grab some label paper and cover that up the reason I use label paper is because um, the back is like um, not, it's not see-through because it's got like um, blocking stuff on the back to block out whatever's underneath. So see, so I'm just going to um, cut this to cover that up and and then we'll have to like put in June again, but that's okay, we can do that. It's time to clean these stickers, they're getting gummed up. Stickers, why do I do that all the time? I'm so used to saying stickers that like, I call my scissors stickers all the time. Anyway, it's time to clean them because they get gummed up and what I've discovered with cleaning scissors is it's best to use Goo Gone and just need a little bit. Just um, clean it with Goo Gone and then make sure you wash them really well. Um, it's not even this week yet. <laughs> I'm filming this early. Make sure you wash your scissors really well with soap and water after you put the Goo Gone on them because the Goo Gone's greasy. And then after that, something's on there. After that, um, make sure that you leave them like open really wide to dry and try to get into the cracks as much as possible. Like I usually dry them with a paper towel um, as much as I can and then like do this and dry them here and do this and dry them here. And then I leave them open to dry naturally so that like I don't want my scissors to get rusty because scissors aren't really cheap. So, and like if I have a good pair, I don't want to lose them. Like I did my other ones, the yellow um, Cutter B scissors that I never found. They went in this, they're gone. Someday I'll find them, but it's been about six months or eight months or something so far and nothing. But anyway, that's besides the point. So we're gonna need boxes for obvious reasons. Maybe I will be layering 
some boxes. Ooh, that's really cute. I could have put that there, but I kind of like the black one better. All the things, these are so cute. I really like those. I wasn't gonna buy this book at all, but I also like these long ones here. Let's put some like rainbowy fun quotes in here. Some boxes. Um, let's just look in the front for like these kinds of things. I like this. Do more of what makes you happy. Because life is what you make of it. And it's important to do things that make you happy because what else is there? I know you can't do things all the time that make you happy, but we can try. Um, let me get some, I know, I know, black boxes. Um, I'm going to grab some of those. Somewhere I have some on a piece of wax paper that I did not use. Let me go see if I can find those. Okay, so I had pulled these um, box stickers off of a classic wellness planner spread that I never wrote in. I had a lot of boxes on there and I thought, well, since I like didn't take the time to write in it that week, because I, I try to write it in every week and I do most weeks, but every once in a while, I'll just be busy and won't do it because it's like a journal and you know how sometimes you fall off a little bit. Um, so anyway, I have these boxes from that and I'm going to use some of these and then I have the colorful boxes book, the monthly one, and there's definitely some black ones still in here. So let's see what we can do. Um, next week, I actually have things going on. <laughs> Imagine that. Um, I have an appointment on Monday and an appointment on Thursday. Wait, Thursday? Uh, I have to look. Wait a minute. Let me look at my phone because, like, I still do keep appointments on my phone. Just not, like, then I transfer them. So, let's see. Oh, wait, I'm thinking of the wrong week. All right, sorry, I'm thinking of the wrong week because I'm planning a couple weeks out right now. I was thinking about next week. Okay, so um, my mom's birthday is on the 24th and my niece's birthday of no, that's not till the 1st. So the only thing I have going on is my mom's birthday, but we're going to put boxes down pretty much every day anyway because I want to make it fun and I'll always have things to write in it. You know what I mean? So I'm not even sure why I looked because... Um, I didn't need to, but we're going to put like, we're going to do some black boxes, but then also some colorful boxes. Um, not, not like from the book, but actually like bright colorful boxes as well. So I think maybe just two black boxes. That's for my mom's birthday and the rest of it. Um, it doesn't really matter where I put the other black box, I guess. Um, maybe up here. For any plans I might get on Sunday. Okay. Because now that things are opening back up a little bit, I actually might have some plans once in a while, which is good. So let's see the kind of boxes that are in here. Um, oh, I wanted to layer. What if I layered this? Um, let me get a smaller box so I can layer. I'm gonna put this down here. I'm gonna layer. I guess this will be for Monday. I'm gonna cut the washi tape underneath so that you don't see it through the sticker.
So since I have a black box here, I'm gonna put one over here as well and then put some other colorful boxes in there, like I said. So maybe I wanna layer, I really like this. Actually, I might wanna layer a colored box on top of this one. So let's see what else is in this book as far as boxes go. I guess let's use one of these. I don't know about this color. Maybe. Hmm. There's a lot of orange and yellow and pink in here, but let's keep going with it. I know you can see that sticker underneath. It doesn't like concern me that much. So I know that's a little crooked. All right, I'm gonna move it. That does concern me. <laughs> I don't know if they've changed the stickers or the paper in the planners, but has anybody noticed that it's harder to pull stickers up than it used to be? Or is it just me? Oh, maybe I want to take, all right, that's what's bugging me. The white, I mean the washi tape, let's take that out. it on the other side. Okay, that looks cute. It's bright and cheery. So since we have this one, I feel like I do want to use this one on this side. So I'm going to go ahead. Let's see, should I overlap that one a little bit? I probably should have used this for my mom's birthday. That's really cheery, but I didn't. So um, I'm gonna need a box on this day though. I could cover the flowers. I don't know if I really want to. If I see, here's my problem. If I put it here, there's like this line. I always wanna tr avoid having a line like that where your eye just goes like that. And also there's one there. So it would be like one long line. I don't want that. Um, so I think I'm gonna put it more up here. Let me do it this way. That's better, okay. I'm gonna need like a quote down here. Let's look for that quote to put in the, in the corner. These are all kind of big here. This is the right size, but I kind of don't like it because of that green color that's in there. It's a bit much. This, this is the right color, but it's a little busy looking for me, a little messy. How about this one? What color do you feel like today? That's cute. Let's try that. That's cute. So now what? All right, you know what I'm gonna do, right? If you watch my videos, I think you know what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna bring in a checklist stencil. One of these days I'm gonna do a spread that doesn't include checklists, but I really like my checklist, so I'm gonna keep doing them. I'm gonna use black marker, a um, Pentel Energel, and I'm just going to put some lines in almost on each day. Yeah, I got a little pen there. We'll take care of that with some white out.
Okay. It's looking cute so far, right? So we have a box on each day, except we need a box, probably a box here, a box on Friday and Saturday. So, cause this one's gonna be for Thursday. So let's look. Um, oh, I wanted to bring in another one of these black boxes so we can layer that. Maybe we'll layer it right on top of that one. Um, I guess that's okay. We'll do that. And then maybe like a colored box for here since there's like, I don't know. Let's look again. Is there like a small, smaller box? I guess not. I wanted to use these ones because they're super bright. Oh, look, I found this page. I didn't see this before. I could have used this. I kind of like that one though. It's cute. I didn't see this one either. <laughs> this would have been cute. It's okay. I like this one. <laughs> it's fine. I mean, I could do priority or don't forget. Um, probably in like this teal color. And the reason I'm picking that is that there is this and this there. I think that's the way to go. I'm not positive, but that's probably gonna be good enough. You can't really go wrong with any of these colors. Okay, so now I have a box on every day. My mom's birthday, maybe I wanna do like something fun. Let's pull out the Celebrate book. I forgot all about this sticker that I just saw on the side of my desk. That's the one I wanted to use instead of that one. Let's put it back before I forget. I'll just stick it here. So let me grab the Celebrate book or the Life is a Party. Um, I'm gonna like start to have to put these in alphabetical order so I don't have to pause the video to find a book. But for right now, I'm just, I found the Celebrate. Let's just look at that one. Um, I can't really put balloons coming up from it because those are in the way. So let's see. I could use one of these. Um, luckily, like these colors match these colors. Let's take this because look, this is really perfect. Look at that. It like is the same colors as this. So... I'm gonna like put this at the top of the box. You can always do this to kind of brighten up a box and make it fun. Um, I kind of like the pink, the hot pink there though. So let's use that side. Okay. So that just adds like a fun little, let's do the bottom too. I'll do like this, turn it around. It just adds a fun little touch to your boxes sometimes. Um, just to give them a little punch. You can do this with these kinds of stickers or you can do it with washi tape. I think that's really cute. So that's gonna be my mom's birthday. I can't wait to write that in there. So I don't think I need to write anything else in there because I already have like that colorful stuff. So um, maybe I should make this one colorful too, actually. Even though that's supposed to be special for my mom's birthday, like it would balance it out if they were both like fun and colorful. So let's do that.
it's always fun to jazz up your boxes. All right, it's looking super cute. I'm really liking it. Like, it's so fun, isn't it? Um, but I'm not done yet because I'm a little extra. So let's put some extra stickers down here. I think little quotes. So let's find those quote, those pages of quotes that I like messed up on, forgetting to use them. Maybe some of these like discs, they're really cute, but maybe not. So happy, 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 because this is like a totally happy spread, isn't it? Where do I want it though? I guess that's good. And Maybe something for here. Of course, I have to leave room to write, but I typically only use my lines and then use the boxes. If I, like, sometimes I will have, um, I always leave some room for, like, extra boxes if I need them. So that happens sometimes. Um, Be the brightest color in someone else's day. You guys, go out and make somebody smile today, okay? There's a lot of people who need to, to um, smile today. So either somebody you know or a stranger, just make somebody smile. That's your homework. Okay, um, I might be done. I feel like a little something is needed right there, but, oh, and I have to put June at the top. Let's get some colorful letter stickers. So where do I see those? Um, in one of the new books, there's like really colorful, maybe we could use the ones in here, but I don't think they're gonna match. Those kind of aren't the right vibe. Let's get them from the, which book? Um, uh, where'd I find those? I just used them in, I think my rainbow spread. Oh boy. I'll never find them. Let's see what books are right near my desk here. Oh, the Radiant Positivity. Cause that's like the same color palette as we have going on here. Maybe this, there's these. I mean, it's not great. That really wasn't the ones I was thinking of, but maybe they're in the alphabet book. All right. I'm just going to use these ones because I don't feel like searching. J, I just got to make sure I have the letters. U. J, U. N. E. Okay, I have enough. I know the J is crooked. I know it. It's okay. Okay, that's just like a fun June. It doesn't have to match perfectly. I still feel like there's something down here that's like just a little something missing. So maybe we just do one of these little stars or maybe I do bring a couple discs in here or a heart 
Let's grab the discs and just see. Or how about these smileys? They're really cute. Um, nah. I'm not feeling it, even though they're so cute. I'm just not feeling it in this particular spread. So let's go for these stars. Maybe up here. Sometimes all it takes is like a little, little tiny sticker to just kind of pull it together. I don't think anything needs to be over here. But now I need to balance it with another star. Do I want it there? I'm thinking no. Hmm. Maybe just here. Okay, I think that's good. Um, this area is still bugging me, but when I, um, when I write in it this week, like as I write in it, I will fill that sp space up probably with some other colorful sticker. So it, it won't bother me as much as it does now because I'll fix that as I go along. So let me know in the comments down below what you think. I think it's super cute. And if you're interested in purchasing the Color Me Happy book, I'd appreciate it if you would use my link in the description box. Um, because I am a Happy Planner affiliate now, so I just get a very small percentage of your purchase. I would appreciate that. It's of no cost to you. Okay, like, comment, subscribe. Love you guys. See you in my next video. That'll be tomorrow. Tune in. <laughs> All right, talk to you later. Bye.